I first came to see Dr. Ben and his brother Sean a couple years ago. I was losing a lot of my hair. My family was living in a house that had toxic black mold in it. Um, so when I was like 21, I started seeing some hair loss and then we figured that out when I was like 23. Um, I was in a stressful relationship. There was many reasons to why my hair was getting thin and falling out. So I came here and I got the stem cell shots done with Dr. Ben and this is two years after and we just did a second round so that we don't even see that yet. This is the old me. This is what happened. And there was a lot of reasons like the black mold why my hair was falling out and the stem cells did magic on me. Dr. Ben is not paying me to say this. This is real life. This is real life. Um, so I couldn't be happier with it. If you're feeling any, you know, if you're feeling self-conscious about your hair loss or you're dealing with it for whatever reason you may be dealing with it, this could be the answer to help you fix that. Because I look at this photo and I don't even see myself. This is pretty scary to see. Um, so yeah, this for sure changed my life. Um, Dr. Ben knows what he's doing. So click, click the link above and come check it out if you feel like you need it too. Because with work or social life, this is a big hit. So, you know, don't be embarrassed and just come, come check it out. Losing hair at a young age is, is pretty shocking, you know? You'll, you'll cover it up wearing hats or whatever. That's what I've always done even when I had a ton of hair when I was younger. Um, so, you know, it's a scary thing. So it's totally normal to feel super self-conscious about it, for sure. Before I got the stem cell shots, there were definitely certain things I tried to get it to come back or become thicker, whether it's a shampoo or, or whatever it may be. Um, but nothing worked as significant as this procedure. And it was super easy. You know, it took 20 minutes, 30 minutes. You get numbing shots in your head before the stem cells. Totally worth it. When we were doing the procedure, I got laughing gas, which made it pretty fun. And there wasn't much pain. I mean, it hurt a little bit, but it's nothing outweighs the, the, the results. When you, when you get this procedure done, you show up to the office, uh, get your blood drawn. It sits for like 30 minutes and they mix it with the stem cells and then numbing shots in your head and then a bunch of injections with uh, your blood and the stem cells. And it's like a 45 minute in and out. You could drive when you leave and you're good the next day, same day. The procedure was super comfortable, super easy. I definitely recommend it. Even if you're someone who is a tough time with needles or pain, you definitely can handle this because I hate needles. After the procedure, there's not much discomfort. Like if you touch it, it may hurt a tiny bit, but that's only for like a day and a half. You have to wear tape on your forehead to prevent swelling coming down to your eyes from the numbing shots. And that's it. So a couple months after you get this done, you'll start to see like baby hairs coming in and your hair starts to get more full and you start to see your scalp less and it's a pretty surreal feeling. Um, and I'm excited to see that again, a level up now that we've done it again two years after the first, first time we've done it. Five years ago, I started to see hair loss. I was moving out of a house that had black mold in it. Two years ago, I came to see Dr. Ben and we got the stem cell shots. Three months after that, way less scalp you could see, a lot of hair came in. And then fast forward two years, hair is still full, way better than it was this day, which was two years ago. And normally every couple of years you do this, but I could have probably waited another year. So then we just did it again. So in three months, it'll be full again, more full. Because of Dr. Ben and these stem cell shots, there's, you know, I could wear no hat in a video. You know, I don't have to feel as self-conscious if I wake up, I have no hat on, I'm around people. Um, Cause that was definitely real life for me where I was like, if I wake up and I was looking like how I looked a couple of years ago after the mold affected my hair loss, then I'd feel super self-conscious. I'd make sure I get a hat on immediately. 
but now I can kind of go throughout my day without having to over stress about that or over focus about that and kind of just be able to live my life without this controlling my thought process on who I'm talking to or where I'm going or what I'm wearing that doesn't really affect me anymore at all. So this is me after living in a house with toxic black mold, being in a stressful relationship and dealing with natural hair loss. And the stem cell shots completely brought so much hair back. This is two years after the procedure. Um, and we just did another round of it with Dr. Ben. So if you're dealing with any of this, this is definitely the place to come.